Well, hello everyone, Interior Garden here, back with another brand new automation tutorial. And today, this is the third installment of the Sweet Shop mod that Zort made. That's available now on the Steam Workshop, of course. So, this mod is awesome. A uh, playthrough of it will be coming out momentarily, probably in the you know beginning of November, depending on when you guys are watching this video. But basically, it has hard candy sweeties. It has candy floss or cotton candy, as is known usually in North America, and then it also has the lollipops, which lollipops are lollipops. So it's all this all start all three of these all start with the same basic principle. You combine the sugar with the syrup with water to make your candy, and you cook it. That's it. The previous two, you use a hard tray. And you you wrap it or you put it in a flossing machine, etc. But this one, the lollipops are a bit different. You actually cook it, you put it on a lollipop tray, and you add sticks to it. Now these are the same sticks that you use for the candy floss, but this tray here for lollipops only have two. And it runs through, it does its you know proofing, if you will, or hardening. It gets then put on to um, a portioner that portions the sticks and the light bulbs out and then you have to actually wrap them as well so let's just uh, load this up you guys can watch it work and this one's very fun because it basically combines both not both things but it's like you're combining sticks with candy and then you're wrapping it as well so that's part of the sweeties and then you have the candy floss which are using the sticks so part of that one and the previous one i actually used two trays to make it go faster but with this because there's only four um, two, there's no need to have another tray. It won't matter. And as you see here, it gets wrapped. And as far as I know, they're all blue, even though some of the paper, well, it's pink paper, but they all turn blue. I think the idea is like it's pink on one side, blue on the other. It's just how it works. I think it's kind of a cute because this looks like it's the lollipop is pink. Now it has a little bit of blue, it gets portioned out, combined. And there you go. So this one's actually pretty good. Now you remember, this is the third or the other one. So you always start out with the sweeties. And then you can get these two cards afterwards. So when you're having your restaurant, you're going to never just have lollipops. You're never just going to have candy floss. So it'll be, you know, a plus plus, which is a good way to have options because, you know, the automation is pretty big for what this does. But again, if you have even have the base candy automated or have the wrapping automated or something automated, if you want to go that route, this one's a bit of a clunkier because you have to have it five wide because you have to have this bin up here because when this all backs up and this backs up, you're going to have spent candy that's no good that you have to bin. So you have to kind of have a bin somewhere. Um, you could probably combine this a little bit, make it a little more compact. But this one right now is seven by five. Uh, not a big deal. Or you could do the hardening part automatically because again unless this is always completely backed up the prep stations are always optional of course but always highly recommended then you won't have issues with the bin but you can play around with it as you like but that's basically we'll get out of this the automation for making lollipops pretty sweet i should say short and sweet pretty sweet if you guys enjoyed the video please consider leaving me a like as well as a comment it would be much appreciated and if you're enjoying this mod or any other automation videos Hit that subscribe button, tick the bell notification icon. Also, stay tuned. Likely in the beginning of November, depending on when you're watching this, and maybe out already. I'm planning on doing a sweet treats or a sweet shop Halloween run, all combined together. It's gonna be super, super fun, guys. So stay tuned for that. And as always, I'll catch you next time.